For dinner tonight, we're making chicken parm from the Weight Watchers app. So the first thing is to preheat your oven to 400. Grease your big frying pan. Take a pound of ground chicken and then season it. So I'm going to do some garlic powder. And then it calls for just oregano, but I'm going to use the Kinder's garlic and herb seasoning because that's like Italian seasoning and all the other things. So there's that. And I'm going to mix that together. So there's already salt in the seasoning I use, so I am just going to add some black pepper that I grated in my pepper grinder, and we're gonna mix that into the chicken. So now we moved the ground chicken mixture that's all seasoned to the frying pan, and I'm just going to spread it out in the frying pan with the spoon until there's a thin, evenly spread layer in there. I've already made this before, and it is so good. It's our favorite, one of our favorite ways to make chicken parm now because it gets so crispy and it's just really good. So once your oven preheats to 400, you're going to put the skillet, so you have to make sure that it's an oven safe skillet, into the oven for eight to 10 minutes for the first round. So now that your chicken has baked the first time, when you take it out of the oven, you're going to spoon some marinara sauce onto it and basically build your chicken parm. So spoon a little bit on there and I just have store-bought marinara sauce. That's what the recipe calls for. So you can use whatever kind you like. And then you add two kinds of cheese to the chicken parm. So grated Parmesan cheese. I just have this jar and that's the end of it. And then also some heart skim mozzarella. So I have some right here and I'm just gonna sprinkle that on top. And then once everything is on there, it's gonna go back into the oven. So we're gonna put this back into the oven for 10 to 15 minutes until the cheese is bubbly. Is the finished chicken. I broiled it for the last two minutes and then we are serving it. And here is the chicken. A quarter of the pan is five Weight Watchers points and I served it with some chickpea pasta.